Ethan Hawke reveals the advice that he received from Denzel Washington after his Oscar loss. Washington and Hawke were co-stars in the 2001 Antoine Fuqua film Training Day. Hawke received his first Oscar nomination for Training Day, nominated for Best Supporting Actor. Hawke lost out on the award to Jim Broadbent, who won for his performance in Iris. Speaking on the Max series, Who's Talking to Chers Wallace? Via Variety, Hawke unveils the advice that Washington gave to him following this Oscar loss. According to Hawk, Washington said, it's better that you didn't win. Losing was better. Washington's reasoning was that one does not want an award to improve your status, but rather their win should improve the award status. Hawk went on to praise Washington, saying, the Academy Award has more power because of Washington's wins. Check out the full quote from Hawk below. Multiple Ethan Hawk roles should have won him an Oscar. As Hawk references, Washington is a decorated actor who has been nominated for multiple Oscars, winning two. One of said Oscars was for the same movie, Training Day, for which Hawk lost out on Best Supporting Actor. Washington's first Oscar win came in 1990 for his supporting role in 1989's historical drama Glory. His other nominations include nods for films such as Cry Freedom, Malcolm X, Flight, and Fences. Hawk, on the other hand, has only received two acting Oscar nominations, for Training Day and Boyhood. This history, however, is no knock to Hawk's acting prowess, but rather the roles that typically are recognized under the eyes of the Academy. Hawk's greatest strength as an actor is conveying a believable person in an understated manner. He reveals this in films like Boyhood or Richard Linklater's Before Trilogy. These roles are less flashy and thus less Oscar bait why, but nonetheless consistently showcase Hawk's strength as an actor. There are multiple roles for which Hawk should have taken home an Oscar besides just Training Day, but perhaps the most glaring is his loss for Boyhood. Characteristic of the Oscars, the award for Best Supporting Actor went to a far more overstated role, honoring J.K. Simmons' performance as the loud and abusive music instructor Terence Fletcher in Whiplash. Another stellar, subtly rendered Hawk performance includes his role in Dead Poets Society. The day Hawk manages to take home an Oscar will be a win for the Academy's recognition of more understated work.